Hey, so it's Turntable Tuesday, ready to video. I got some front jerks this morning, this morning, some front squats. Got a little bit of knee pain, uh, I think from my left leg always blocking me off at the front of the circle. It's causing me some knee pain. Um, in the morning, before I even lift, I'm gonna do a couple like spinning drills with a shot, just cause I'm trying to do something throwing oriented before I lift which is hard for me because I train people all morning, but uh, time to head over, start training. Training for 19 meters, baby. what I'm watching when I'm throwing. Goat sleeping up there. And this pig, I don't even know what he's doing. Like digging through the tarp.
So it's really starting to warm up. Um, today's a great example of how tired I can get. I don't know if it's from my training. It's partially from my training, partially from Lyme disease. But I took a couple throws. I started getting jittery in my legs, like I was ready to kill one. And then I just started pressing everything and couldn't feel technique at all. Took about 25 half turns with uh, 22 pounders. And I'm freaking dead. Um, but I want to tell you how my, my mind thinks. So on my best throw today, I went 58-1 went with a 17, which is a decent throw for me in training. And uh, my son was screaming for me to go to the bathroom while I, in the middle of the throw. Well, right before I was about to throw. But one thing is that, that sort of like motivates me because I sit there and go, you know, I'm spending all this time training and being selfish when I should be spending more time with him. You know, he's out here with me too, but it, it's just little things like that that, can, that you can use to motivate yourself to really be efficient with your training and with your time and, and with everything, you know, everything in life, not just throwing, but, you know, when you're sitting there with your hand down your pants watching TV and your kid's playing, shut the TV off, go play with your kid, but... I guess that's a that's one of the lessons from today.